Hey guys, EBP Man here, and in today's video, we're gonna take a look at the Quiet Comfort. These are the brand new Bose earbuds. We're gonna do a EBP Man style call quality and audio test and check out all the features. Let's get right to it. Now, before taking a closer look at the earbuds and also what's in the box, just check out Amazon's website so we can learn more about this product. So we're seeing $279 retail. Uh, they will be available October 15th, so just days away. And as we zoom in, we'll take a look at some of the features here. Now, Bose is known in the industry for their active noise canceling, and they not only have one or two settings, but they have various settings. Uh, these have to 11 settings, 11 levels of active noise canceling. That's really gonna allow you to have an immersive experience when it comes to, you know, if you're studying, if you're doing work, listening to music, whatever situation you are, this is gonna really give you that immersion, the immersive experience that you're looking for. Now, also, you have uh, great audio quality. So over the years, Bose has been improving the audio and we've seen that even on the Bose 700 with the included now um, equalizer, the audio, uh, say quality has, and sound signature has improved. The one thing I will mention is that I've already tested these out and they don't have an equalizer feature in the app for it. So just make sure that you understand that. So the signature you get or the experience you get is pretty much the same for everyone, unless you're using a phone that has a separate equalizer like the Samsung line does. Now, uh, Comfort, we're gonna see how the Comfort is. They're IPX4 rated. They have a uh, battery life of up to six hours in a single charge. And if you charge them for 15 minutes, they have quick charging technology. 15 minutes is gonna give you two hours of usage, which is also really competitive and good. Uh, the case is gonna give you up to 12 more hours of battery life. And it does have uh, Qi charging uh, capabilities. But I will tell you, uh, and you'll hear this from a lot of other reviewers, they're probably one of the largest cases I've seen on the market, which I don't know why they're that large. It doesn't really justify the battery itself to have something that big, but it's not the most pocketable. Uh, but I'm not going to dwell too much on that. It's, it is what it is. Now, from a Bluetooth perspective, you're looking at Bluetooth 5.1, and it's going to work around 30 feet, and you're not going to have any kind of sync issues, any kind of YouTube um, or, let's say, Hulu, Netflix, any of those videos that you're watching. You won't have any issues when it comes to the audio quality, losing sync with the actual person who's speaking or what you're watching. Also, I've had no issues with gaming either. Now, uh, from a microphone perspective, uh, you do have great mics on this, and we're going to do an EBP Man style audio quality and call quality test, so you're going to be able to hear exactly how I hear them and also hear what a caller would hear when they're speaking to you on these. Now in the box you're going to find your earbuds with their ginormous case, uh, two uh, wing stabilizers that are also your earbuds, uh, it's a combo, and then a USB-C cable. Now as you take a closer look at the case, you do have USB-C in the back, you have a fuel gauge in the front, it does support wireless charging, you can see how it's charging there, you'll see the fuel gauge in front lit up as soon as I uh, put it on this uh, charging mat, you see that in a second. There you go. And uh, it does keep your earbuds secure. They're not gonna come out. It has this little push button here that opens up and they are magnetically locked. You do have this rubberized area here that puts some pressure on the earbuds to make sure that they're locked in place. You do have a Bluetooth, um, I'd say pairing button here. Uh, they guide, so they lock in really nicely. And uh, again, it, it feels, even though it's large, it feels like it's gonna be a secure case uh, that should be pretty durable. Now, as we take a closer look at the earbuds themselves, you do have um, some contact points here that are for charging. You have your left and right indicator. They um, do not have a independent use. So when you're using these, you have to use your right one in at all times. It's the one that is, is kind of the controller. And the other one is going to be the one that connects to that controller. So you cannot use them independently. So the Galaxy Buds, the Galaxy Live, you think about all these other earbuds where you can have independent use, these are not them. Uh, they are relatively large. Uh, so they're gonna be similar to what I would say the Sony's in size. And if you're curious about what these things look like, Let's go ahead and put these on so you can see what it looks like right here. So literally the way you take these is you put them in your ear here and then you twist in place. Put it in your ear and you twist and it locks in. And I'll say that even though they're larger, they do feel relatively um, comfortable in my ears. Um, I haven't used them for you know 18 hours straight or for more than let's say a couple hours at a time. So making sure that you have the right fit is gonna be important to have the right comfort. They don't feel like they're weighing down, which is important for me. And I would say that the uh, the silicone itself, this design from, from Bose is really good. This is a really soft silicone. I have had no irritation in my ear, but again, you're looking at something that has this profile. Let me turn to the right, let me turn to the left. So uh, this is the kind of profile that you can expect when you have these. Now the Bose app is very mature. You have it both for Android and also for iOS. And as you can see here, you basically see your earbuds, you see your left and right battery life, you see the volume level that you can control in the app, 
right? Or what you could do is also control it with the dials on the side. It's the same thing. Uh, noise canceling, as you move up to any one of these settings, you can actually hear it as I'm speaking. I can hear it um, canceling out noise. And when it's all the way on this side, basically what you have is transparency mode. And the transparency mode doesn't sound robotic at all. Uh, you do have some interesting settings or some nice controls in the settings area so that you can actually uh, determine, uh, for example, uh, by pressing uh, this side, you can actually determine you know what levels of active noise canceling do you go into so you could do a favorite of 10 which is the highest or close to highest you could do a favorite of two or you and that's five and then you could do three which is going to be your transparency mode so you can actually cycle through things uh, really nicely and as we go back you also then have in-ear detection which you can turn on or off right so basically here what you're doing is uh, enabling autoplay or not um, auto transparency mode um, or not so you have a lot of these little controls that you can play with one of the things that you will notice is that you also have self voice so that as you're on phone calls you can actually hear yourself and you can determine how loud it is this is great because then if you've ever been with someone uh, on an elevator or when we were more closer uh, those people who s tend to speak really loud is because they can't hear themselves so everyone hears their conversation because they're speaking on the phone and they can't hear how loud they are so this is going to help you in, in those situations one of the things that is not here uh, is again an equalizer so you'll have to go with the sound signature that it has and the settings it has unless you have a built-in I would say um, equalizer like the Samsung phones do so uh, let's check out the audio quality and hear what the audio experience sounds like and I will tell you this right off the bat bass mids and highs are present has great music separation has great passive uh, noise canceling combined with the active noise canceling is going to give you a super immersive experience from an audio quality perspective I'd say you're not going to go wrong is it Sennheiser quality? The answer is no. Is it Bose quality? The answer is yes. And that's not a bad thing. It's just different. Uh, is it, how does it compare to Sony and some of the other ones out there? Well, you know, that's, uh, that's going to be subjective to what your sound signature preference is. But great bass, great mids and highs. Sound stage is great. Immersive experience. But why don't you be the judge of it? Let's go into our audio test next. Let's check it out. I've been feeling so small. Watch the clock ticking off the wall But tonight I'm letting it go Spend my coin for sure I'm gonna be myself Or I could be someone else No one's stopping me now I'm gonna skip my breaks I'm gonna make mistakes I just wanna feel alive It's just what I Said you needed a break and left with no heads out I was strong for your sake but it made my heart drown Cause it's always been you and I Give me one more try, this is messing with my mind Now Try to make up your mind like you need more time You've already spent most of mine Now we're doing a call quality test of the Bose Quiet Comfort in a quiet environment. Check a look at our decibel readings. Anywhere from 22 to 28 decibels in noise. Let's go ahead and switch. Uh, this is what the call quality would sound like when making a phone call on the Quiet Comfort earbuds in a quiet environment. This is a test. One, two, three. This is a test. This is what the Bose Quiet Comfort sound like in a quiet environment. Next, let's go into a noisy one. Now we're in a much noisier environment, and as you can look at our decibel ratings, anywhere from 40 all the way up to 78 decibels of noise. What we're going to do is we're going to switch to the Bose Quiet Comforts. We're going to stay quiet to see how much noise is being eliminated, and then we'll go into the call quality test. Let's go to switch. Now this is what the Bose Quiet Comforts sound like in a noisy environment. 
This is a test, one, two, three, this is a test. This is what the Quiet Comfort sound like in a noisy environment. So guys, that wraps up our review of the Quiet Comfort True Wireless Earbuds from Bose. If you're still looking for True Wireless Earbuds that have great active noise canceling or have great audio quality, make sure you check out our playlist.